Hi, this is Lance from HealthySimulation.com. We're at IMSH 2014 in San Francisco. I'm at the Sidra, which is a very interesting and unique booth, uh, kind of different from some of the other uh, locations that, uh, that we're seeing here. I'm with Joanne, Joanne, right? Yeah, Joanne Davies. And uh, <laughs> we're we're um, we're talking now about this new simulation. Uh, building and program that's going to be opening up in Qatar yeah. in 2015. That's right. Yeah. Cool. So tell First us question. a little bit about it. So um, Sidra Medical and Research Centre um, is a women and children's hospital. It's going to be a 450 bedded women and children's hospital um, to meet the needs of the community in Qatar. Um, we're a greenfield hospital, so we're building the hospital and opening it in 2015, as we said. And part of the opening of the hospital, we're going to be um, building a simulation centre and program to help orientate the staff. Yeah, so tell me more yeah. about that specifically. So you're going to, before the hospital actually opens up to the public, yeah. you're going to be utilizing simulation to train and orient that staff to the, the, to the building, uh, to certain procedures, to working together, and Absolutely. to the systems check so that you guys can make sure that everything is really working well. Tell us more about that. Absolutely. We've got a huge cohort of people coming into Sidra, so over 5,000 staff will be joining us in Sidra from all over the world. And if you think about the unique challenge of bringing different people with different cultures, different standards, into a new hospital with new equipment and systems, we have to ensure for a safe patient opening that we've not only looked at individual performance but also team performance how we work together and then we move on to look at the systems and we collect data on systems it'll also give us a unique opportunity to capture data for research um, doing a project like this with simulation so tell yeah. me a little bit about the country you've been living there now for a few years yes. and, and uh, yeah, where'd yeah. you come from and, and what what brought you out there and what do you think about the, uh, the, the country well I'm originally from the UK I'm a, I'm a clinician myself, I'm a, a midwife from the okay. UK, so I've done a lot of travelling because my husband worked with the US military, so okay. I've travelled in the, um, I've obviously worked in the UK and in Australia and in the Middle East. So I've worked in Qatar for the last four years and I've worked on the hospital project and now we've moved over into operations and I um, took over as the director of simulation. Um, six months ago which was fantastic. Qatar is an amazing place to, to live and work. Um, it's a, a country that's growing in terms of um, it has a strong economy and it's developing itself in terms of the structure uh, of Qatar but more importantly um, uh, Sheikh Moza, who is supporting the Sidra project is really growing the country in terms of its um, uh, education and the education of its people and investing in people to help build hospitals, schools and um, create sort of a, a knowledge environment. Well it sounds like yeah. quite an adventure and Absolutely. definitely in a place that's uh, looking to be innovative and start something new that's which right. is awesome. So yeah. uh, I guess if people are interested in such an opportunity, yep. that, uh, who, who are we looking for at this point for Sidra? Well we're actually recruiting for a number of positions, um, everything from physicians, nurses, allied health professionals, um, people to work in HR and administration, education and obviously simulation which I'm plugging for at the moment is uh, we're looking for simulation technology specialist educators to come and join the team and help us to um, really open this hospital. It's an amazing project and, a, and a, a unique opportunity for people to come and use simulation to, to innovate and do research and um, uh, open the hospital. Yeah, and it's yeah. always great to work at the very ground floor of a simulation program because uh, you get such an opportunity to see the thing and help the thing grow. Absolutely. And then there's lots of promotion opportunities because you're yeah. the, the first name that comes to, to thought when, that, when, when that, we're ready to expand. That's right. It's um, it is. I mean, I you know the opportunities for your career within Sidra is fantastic there's a number of positions and we're a women and children's hospital so um, there's always a need in, in the Middle East for for those types of uh, projects and it's fantastic Great. yes so where can folks want learn more about the project? Um, you can go to www.sidra.org to learn about the project as a whole um, you can also contact me directly at jdavis at sidra.org and I'm happy to answer any questions that people have especially around the simulation program absolutely well thank you so thank much thank you Lance really it's lovely to meet you thank you